Okay, so uh, <clears throat> thought I'd do a quick review. I know I relied a lot on online comments and reviews when I was shopping for different stuff and things. So I thought I'd do a review on my Cub Cadet LTX 1040 lawn tractor. Um, I've had it, this is the first season with it. It's, um, I guess we're halfway through September. So I have, uh, you know, I've put almost a full season on it uh, since I bought this property. I would have to say that all in all, I'm very pleased with this tractor. Uh, seems to, to cut really nice. Uh, I like a lot of the features, although it's one of the lower end cadets. It is definitely a, a very nice mower. It's got a 42 inch cut. Seems to cut nice and flat and even. I liked that it came standard with the wheels on the deck. That's not a standard uh, deal. It's also got this smart uh, wash system. So after you cut about every other week, I usually hook the hose up and let the tractor run and it'll hose out very thoroughly the bottom so I don't have to get underneath there and scrape it. Uh, the tractor itself, it's got an adjustable seat which is nice. I don't, it doesn't matter to me because it's always all the way back but when my wife wants to cut, she's able to slide the seat forward and back. So that's kind of a nice feature. Um, it's got uh, about 10 cutting positions, PTO engagement, you know, pretty standard. Um, uh, it doesn't have multiple uh, drive gears, it's sort of uh, the farther, the harder down you push it, the, the faster it goes, hydrostatic I guess they call that. Um, you know, not a lot to tell about it, it's a, it's a pretty base model tractor, 19 horse, it does have the circulating system for the oil uh, which a lot of them in this size didn't and again with this uh, abuse I'm putting this thing through I thought that was a good idea um, holds a fair amount of fuel I'm able to cut my lawn uh, on well less than half a tank and it takes me about and eh, with the terrain and all that probably about an hour and a half to cut uh, everything I have to cut with it um, has, uh, it is able to mow in reverse, which I like. If I wasn't able to mow in reverse, that would have to disengage the uh, drive every time. would be a real pain if they do have to do a lot of backing up. I have an irregular kind of shaped uh, yard. So I am able to cut. There's a little uh, safety procedure you have to go through. Uh, you know, basically uh, put the key to reverse mode, press the button, the light comes on, then you can put it in reverse while the uh, mower is engaged. Just keeps you thinking in case there's something behind you. Um, but it runs good. Go ahead and fire it up here. So uh, I'll try to kind of demonstrate one of the things about the tractor that impressed me the most when I was shopping and now that I own it as well uh, is that really tight turning radius for a standard lawn tractor with conventional steering, not a zero turn. It's got about the tightest turning radius, turning radius of anything that I could find. Uh, and it really works well for the obstacles I have to cut uh, you know, I just uh, finished cutting this little area over here, which, you know, I expected when I bought the place to have to push mow this. And, uh, you know, with the turning radius on that thing, I actually was able to cut all of this uh, with the rider, which was nice. 